Greetings everyone. Regarding Christmas, Mystery Mina has been online, I think, of the reset, which is today. So in today's video, I want to discuss this gacha event, whether you should even go for it or not. Now, there is a problem when it comes to this gacha. It's a percentage. You either be a lucky person or not. My whole problem and my whole issue with mystery mania, mania is the fact that there is nothing guaranteed, which means the following. You can get any repetitive item from here, from the list, or you could be lucky and get one of the new major decorations. Obviously, people want to collect them because of their passives and uh, to at least unlock their skill, even if it's only once. So we have here two, one is the blue and one is the purple. Whether you are low spender or free to play or someone who wants to buy, first of all, you cannot get anything for free. You need this currency. If you went for the normal blue, you have to buy the currency you have here called tickets. These tickets, you can use them to summon these. There is one thing which is interesting though. As you can see, there are levels here. There are stars. This means if you own this, if you own this specific decoration, every single time you pull it from this pool, it will be exchanged into this new currency, which is, I think it's called star something. These, uh, these star uh, currency, which then you can exchange it for the remaining for the remaining decorations that you don't own but here is here is my problem the whole thing is not really useful but most of the top players or the strong like the strong uh, killers or the hunters will be looking for the following brute force fox's charm or this monkey planner or whatever the name is and their chances are really garbage I think it's like 2% for each, yeah, 2% for brute force, 2% for foxy charm, and 2% for the planner. Which basically means every $500, you might be guaranteed one. Every $500. Why I'm saying every $500? Because a single pull is $5, I think. And yeah, sorry, I think it's 250. Let me see if you even have the tickets. So yeah, you need how many? You need like 20? 20? No, you need more than 20. Uh, let me see. Yeah, I, I, I think it's around that. Maybe 400, 500 range. And that only if you are lucky. Which makes the whole, the whole event is garbage and not really worth it playing how much actually stars you are going to get so we are going to give it a try and even if it fell there is possibility here of you going and exchanging them from for flawless beers so let's give it a try by trying just one for now and see I have received what obviously I did not receive something good Okay, um, I'm not sure this is even maxed. It's not maxed yet for me. It's the worst thing. What? Let me see the odds. Uh, here. It's 10% odds. But again, I think this is garbage. But again, let me try again. And see. I'm gonna keep trying. Won't. See. So here is an example. Right now. I tried with five dollars and since I own the item and it's full already it's giving me 20 of those giving me 20 of those what would this 20 uh, do to me here 20 multiply 5 is, is 100 beers it's crappy as you can see guys it's it's crappy but again for for fun maybe I'm gonna show you with all the the cheap bundles only and then so you know that this thing is completely garbage 
okay this is not bad let me try again one okay repetitive repetitive starlight token something you don't want again hmm. as you can see guys it's really not worth doing because as I said uh, there is no guaranteed chance you would be even getting any of these despite the fact that the uh, yes the look sexy and stuff but no yeah, I really recommend you to stay away completely from this event like uh, here I can even like try I don't want to even try more like it's really waste of money but how many ticks I tried for so <clears throat> let's make it the last one here again so yeah it's it's really for me personally I do not recommend you to try this event at all yeah it's 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 better for you to wait for the ascension at least the ascension is guaranteed I think it's like hundred and fifty dollar for these but this one even if you bid five hundred dollars or four hundred dollars even if you bought all the bundles it's not gonna be guaranteed so I would recommend you to seriously stay away from this event it's really not worth it and it's not guaranteed like if you read the rule there is not even a soft cap for it like it it is a, it's a percentage so even though it says here the odds is, is 2% it, it can it cannot even it, it might not even happen forever like seriously that's it guys and have a wonderful day